friends. As you can tell by the title, I am here with a Timu clothing haul. Okay? Hang on. Let me pour some of my tea in my... Daniel and I took the babies home, and then we stopped by Brahms because I didn't want to cook supper. I was so tired and wore out. I was like, I don't really want to cook. Daniel said, let's just go somewhere. How about that? So we ran by Brahms. Okay. Anyway, that's neither here nor there. Okay, that's neither here nor there. All right, let's get started. As you can tell, it's a clothing haul. It's not that many. Four items, but it was just... I told y'all I'm trying to get... I'm trying to get enough clothes for winter. I know I bought several sweatshirts and long sleeve, but not really a whole lot of nothing. I mean, truthfully, to be truthfully... So, we're going to start with the pants because the pants are just cuter than crap. Actually, let's start with the shirt. Now, I'm not wearing the shirt and the pants together out. I'm putting them together in the video simply because, um, well, because. I guess I can scoot over. I have a curtain hanging here because my clothes, that closet over there, you know, I had Daniel make me a thing, you know, where I can hang my clothes when I'm doing try-ons and stuff. And then the door and all that good stuff. And to me, it's just very distracting, okay? And I want you looking at me, not over there. So I told Daniel, so we'll put up a little curtain so, so these good folk can see me. <laughs> and you guys were right. The uh, barn door curtain was a little bit too close to me. But I still want you to be able to focus on me and not everything, you know. So I just kind of hung up a little um, wrinkled curtain. <laughs> so anyway, <coughs> I don't use that for It's actually a sheet, to be honest. All right, let's get started. Okay, first thing I ordered, because I don't, I think I have, actually I don't even know if I ordered a uh, fall shirt last year. I can't remember. I know I ordered the black cat shirt, but that's not necessarily fall or Halloween. That's just to represent my kitty cat. So anyway, I ordered this one because I thought it was so stinking cute. I had it in my cart for a while and I was like, now wait, let me just tell you, I went up a size. Let me make sure I'm not lying to you, but I'm pretty sure this one I went up a size and I shouldn't have. Uh, yeah, I went up to 3XL because, you know, I like them a little bit oversized. Well, that's usually the sweatshirts, but I shouldn't have on this shirt, okay? Because it's a little bit, you'll see in the picture, it's a little bit big. Um, but that's okay. And it'll probably shrink once I wash it. Most of my clothes, I've already washed these, by the way, but I hung them to dry. It's a V-neck. And it says, it's fall, y'all. Isn't that just so me? I mean, isn't that how I talk? It's fall, y'all. So there's the shirt, and here's what's cute about it. You get stripes at the top of the sleeve, and then you get, <laughs> how cute is that? I mean, okay, I'm going to put the picture up. There you go. Oh, no, I can't put the picture up until I show you pants, so you're not going to put, I'm not putting the picture up just yet. But anyway, isn't that cute? You get stripes, and you get the leopard print. I love it. I love it. It is so stinking cute on, and you're fixing to see how cute it is on after I show you the pants, okay? Because, like I said, I'm putting them together. These were adorable. I had these in my cart for a while. And I kept thinking, Marsha, how old are you? I mean, really. You know, you're 62. You're not six. And you're definitely not two. So, but then I thought, who really cares how old I am? I like them. I think they're cute. And I'm wearing them for Thanksgiving, for our get-together on Thanksgiving. Okay, okay. But now I'm not wearing the shirt with them. But the shirt does look cute with them. Um, this are, these are 2XL because I wear a 2XL. I wear a 2XL up here and down here. But like I said, in the over the, the sweatshirts and stuff, I like oversized. But and I should have went 2XL with that one. But it'll it's fine. Um, here's the the leggings. <laughs> gobble gobble turkey turkey fall leaves. See look here. I'm gonna show you the the hiney. You get pumpkins, you get fall leaves, you get a turkey gobbler, um, you get him before and after. <laughs> Isn't that cute? You get sunflowers, my favorite flower. Is this just not... Okay, now I'm going to put the picture up. 
is this just not the cutest? I mean, and they're very long. I'm 5'7", and these are fine. The, these are fine length. And I may even just wear orange boots with them. Who knows what I'll do. You know? You know, if it's if it's cool, I may wear my orange combat boots. That would look so cute. And I might just show you what they would look like in another video with, or I may just wait until I do actually wear them and then show you the fall boots with them. But, because I do have fall orange combat boots. Yes, I do. Here's the bottom. You can tell by the picture, though. Um, and again, this shirt looks really cute with these. But it's a little bit of overkill, if and you ask me. And um, what will I wear with these? I'm not sure. Um, I don't even remember. I don't think I have a solid orange. I don't know yet. I don't know yet what I'm going to wear with these. And I might order just a solid orange or solid brown or a tan. Something to go with these. Um, sweatshirt. But these are so cute. I mean, is that not just the cutest you ever did see in your entire life? I think so. Okay, so there's that. I thought they were cute. Okay, and then there's this. Let's see, this one first, and then this one. Okay, then I went back. Now, you guys seen... Um, that was the day that I got really sick when we were shopping, remember? And I just had all the, the blisters and... You can still see them on my feet, but they're healing. I mean, they're scabbed over. But you, I didn't really get to show you my outfit with the blue and white stripe. I think it's blue and white striped shirt. But I loved it. I think it was blue. No, it's blue and green. Blue and um, lime green. But then I seen this one, and I'm like, well, I need that too. So... And I went ahead and showed you something. I wore this these pants and um, the shirt that matches those pants, the wellness shirt. I wore that earlier when Daniel and I took the kids home. So, and I still had those on. So I thought, I'm just going to leave them on and put this on because it matches. So why not? So anyway, here's the shirt. It is long sleeve. I'm trying to get some long sleeve in my closet for fall and winter. Um, yellow cuff. At the bottom, yellow. I love that. And then around the... And I think I'm either going to get some yellow leggings or a pair of yellow... I have yellow pants, but they're bell-bottom. And I don't know that I want to wear bell-bottom for, you know, just here, there, and everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Because they're more dressy. So I think I'm going to go back and get uh, a yellow pair like this of either... Um, I don't know. Maybe I'll find yellow jeans. I don't know. Something yellow, probably, or I could get, or just wear this with blue jeans. Now, this would be really pretty with blue jeans, the yellow, and a yellow handbag. That would be, because look, let me show you. Y'all are seeing the picture already, but do you see this? If I could put it where you guys could really get the gist of the yellow and the, here we go. And then that bright yellow bag, wouldn't that not just be, the dog diggity dog or whatever yeah mom diggity is that it so anyway this is this shirt and i love it i love 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 these striped shirts i just think they're cute there's one that uh i've seen a youtuber have one on it's a v-neck she's a plus size girl of um, alexandra rodriguez i started to get that same shirt at least four or five times last year. And then I kept saying, nah, nah. I don't know why, but I did. And now I can't find it. They have one like it, but it's a round neck. And I don't want the round neck. I want the, what is ticking me? I want the V-neck. So I'm going to keep looking. I looked at Sheen. Sheen didn't have it. So now Amazon has it for $39. I'm not paying $40 for that. Why would I do that when I can get it off Tamu for just a little tiny fraction of the price. So I'm going to go back and look and see if I can't find the V-neck. But that's what I'm after. Okay? Okay. Got to wet my whistle. Okay. Last but not least, this one. Now, I know, I do know that I have 
a shirt just like this in pink, okay? The happy face, because I love happy faces, smiley faces. And, uh, but it is a short sleeve t-shirt. So when winter comes, guys, I can't be wearing no short sleeve t-shirt up in the winter because y'all know I'll be freezing. So here's what I got. Y'all see this color? <laughs> Look at this. Happy face. Now, I'm showing it here with uh, shorts because this is the shorts I have on right now and I didn't want to, you know. I will be wearing it with black leggings or just black slacks. I'm not sure. I mean, a casual slack, not a dressy. But it'll either be with black leggings or black slacks. Highly likely black leggings, okay? But this is the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Okay, I love that lime green. Y'all know I love me some lime green. You know, you you know. Oh, and I didn't tell you what sizes these were. This is a 3X because, again, I like it oversized. The blue, and blue, white, and yellow um, sweatshirt is also 3X, 3XL. And I did want to say on this one, it is that slick material on both sides. And um, let me tell you what it is. I'm pretty sure it's probably 90% polyester, 5% spandex, 10%, who knows. Okay, it is 95% polyester, 5% spandex. Is that not what I said? So that's what this one is. It's not a, it's not a regular sweatshirt. I'm grateful for that. Uh, I like it like this because it's not hot. And a regular sweatshirt burns me up if I'm on the inside if I like if I wear it to family gathering whatever I burn up so I like it much better like that and I can always wear a tank top underneath this one is the same way this is um pretty sure it's the same no this is a hundred percent polyester but this is the inside let me show you there you go and um I like it I like it it's heavy enough that'll keep my arms warm keep me warm but yet it's thin enough that it'll keep me cool when I'm on the inside so I can enjoy it in or out I don't necessarily have to just wait till I go outside and this is just the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life okay it's the cutest thing I ever did see so, so, so. so that is my Timu clothing haul I do have oh, another one coming I have a Shein that will get here before the other Timu haul but I don't know what that is, guys. It is sticking the fire out of me. It's on my bralette. How do you like that face? Oh, drives me crazy. Um, Bertha back there, let's just give her a little recognition. She likes it when y'all pay attention to her because she really thinks she's all that in a bag of potato chips. So, you know, don't tell her. Anyway, she is wearing... She's not wearing no draws, okay? Because she has like a stick going up. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, she is wearing a um, leopard, thin leopard shirt. It is by, I bought it at Kato's. I don't know if it's by Kato's, but I bought it at Kato's years ago. And it's really thin. So underneath it, I don't know if you guys can see that right in there and up here. She's wearing a V, V-neck um, tank top. And it's one of those tank tops that I got from Tamu that has, you know, like it's a V-neck, but right here it has like a little, uh, I don't know, just a little pleat or whatever. So it's solid yellow underneath there. And then with the leopard on top, she's wearing, um, the yellow crocodile bag that I got from Tamu, by the way. Um, it looks just like the, it's a dupe for, um, the Brahmin, the, that style and everything. And then the hat is from Walmart, the fedora. And I thought about putting the black corduroy up there, but because well, she needs a nap. I had grandkids for since yesterday. I thought the white would be better because the shirt, the blouse is a short sleeve and um, we are wearing yellow, and I thought I would just pop it with the white fedora, and it would look really cute. Now, if I put some white jeans on under that, it will be rocking, okay? You can put yellow under it, yellow jeans, white jeans, black, 
leggings, I guess. Um, but I think a white jean would be pretty under that. Now, again, that didn't that didn't go with this Timu haul, okay? I mean, I did get the bag from Timu and the tank top from Timu, but that's, that's long ago, okay? Okay, so there's my little Timu haul. It was only four, four things, but I want to go ahead and get it shared with you, so I went ahead and washed it. It came in yesterday, I think. Yesterday or the day before? day before it came in Friday and um, I washed them up got them dried and so I thought well I'll go ahead and get the video do the video today so I can have it ready for you guys on Monday early Monday morning because I realized I did not put up a video on Saturday but I put those other two back to back up or maybe even three so I thought well you know they can watch those and then go back and watch them you know whatever uh, this shirt also came from Tamu. Is this not the cutest shirt you've ever seen? Look at this. Okay, it's a cat holding a mop, which now looks like a guitar between the cat's ears and the mop. <laughs> and then over here is a guitar that looks like the cat. Is that not the cutest thing? And then, of course, I'm wearing um, my black guitar earrings that I got these from Shein, I don't know, a long time ago. I've had these for a very long time, so yeah. Let me turn you up a little bit because I think I just, should I have that over just a tad bit maybe? Yeah, yeah, no, I don't know. Okay, y'all can't even see, can y'all see my fireflies right there? I've got the lights turned on them in that plant. Is that not the cutest? Okay, yeah, okay, what I was going to say is, hang on. Oh, I get so dry mouth. We had Ryan and Riley um, yesterday and last night because her mama had her, I don't remember how many years. She's young. Ten. Ten year high school reunion. School reunion. So we kept the kids yesterday. And we, now we, just, we didn't have Hunter or Kaylin. We just had Ryan and Riley. Um, and they stayed with us yesterday and stayed the night last night. We had Sean. Sean came in on uh, Friday yesterday yeah Sean came in Friday night Friday evening and so he stayed the weekend with us he left this morning and then we took the kids back to meet Brittany today but I was going to tell you she's so funny little Riley the girl's a comedian okay she's just a natural born comedian and she's so smart she she always facetimes me okay on her little iPad She's got my number in there. I mean, she just pushes that button <laughs> all the time. So she FaceTimed me Friday. No, she FaceTimed me Thursday. And then I FaceTimed her Friday. And she said, I got some new makeup. Do you want to see it? And I said, sure. You know, because she's a diva. She's like, Kaylin's a diva too, my oldest granddaughter. She's a diva as well. She loves makeup and, you know all good fun things that women like so I said sure so she I was it's when you FaceTime you know she can see me and I can see her so she grabbed it was a bottle it was about like this and the way she was holding it I could only see I-L-M-I-K I couldn't see nothing else the way she was holding it and I kept waiting for her to put it up and I said Riley is that ill maquillage and she's like huh and I said is that ill maquillage? And she held it up and she said, uh-huh. And I said, where did you get that? And she said, my mama bought it. So she said, hang on. So she went and got her a brush, a makeup brush. And she said, I'm going to put it on and I want you to tell me if it's, if it's my skin color. Okay. And I said, okay. <laughs> like this girl is only six years old. Oh, she's going to be a makeup artist. So she squeezes it on her brush okay she has her brush she squeezes it on her little makeup brush and then she just starts putting it on putting it on and she said after she got done she said well grandma is this the right color is this the right skin color for me and I said well actually it's pretty perfect I don't it's it looks really good and it did it looked really good and she said it does and I said yes so she started to squirt some more she said i may need more and i said no you don't need no more don't waste don't waste your foundation 
And I said, don't waste it. You look fine. You look wonderful. And she said, okay, thank you. Thank you. I just needed to know. Lord Jesus. Now, I don't know if her mama gave her the ill maquillage or if she just took her her makeup. Probably, I'm sure Brittany gave it to her. But she's, she's too much. That girl is too much. She is so stinking funny. So anyway, and, and Ryan's pretty funny too. Now, you guys haven't met Ryan, I don't think. Um, he's pretty camera shy. Ryan's one that he's pretty much self entertaining. I mean, he he'll he will entertain himself. He doesn't need anybody around him. He's he's kind of a he's kind of an introvert. I mean, he talks to people and stuff like that, but he just prefers to be alone. And he'll he plays games and uh, colors and does numbers and stuff on his iPad. And um, Riley's just the opposite. She is little miss. I am all up in your Kool-Aid or any kind of Kool or anybody's Kool-Aid, whatever it may be. But anyway, I, I couldn't wait to tell you guys that because it was just hilarious. Her and her, she's only six years old and she wanted to know if it matched her skin color. I'm like, what? She is my granddaughter, by the way. She is definitely my granddaughter. So anyway, we took we took them home today and um, we stopped and... Daniel chose Brahms because he wanted to shake. I wanted a sweet tea. So anyway, we are home. I'm re I'm fixing to go edit this. So it'll be up for uh, 7 in the morning, which will be Monday. When you're watching this, it'll be Monday. And then I'm going to rest because I'm wore out. I'm, I'm totally exhausted. They're good kids. They're not rambunctious. They're not yelling and screaming and knocking things out. You know, they're, they've been raised very well. I'm proud of my son and my daughter in love. And they're very sweet. But, you know, when you have kids, you have to get up and fix them something to eat. That would be 24-7 because those kids love to eat. And you can't blame them. They're growing kids. And because, um, you know, it's just me and Daniel. Daniel gets hungry. I mean, I will fix supper. But when Daniel gets hungry, he'll just get up and go fix him a sandwich because we try to keep lunch meat and all of that, you know, in the in the refrigerator. And then that's the same thing with me. I'll just get up and fix me some popcorn or, or maybe a sandwich or, you know, we just wait on ourselves when we feel like it. So when you have kids, it's, it's kind of like when you have your kids home, you know, you have to get up and you have to do things. So having said all of that, <laughs> I'm exhausted. I am. Oh, I'm wearing my necklace that says Grandma. I love it. I love being a grandma. I love my babies. I love it. Anyway, um, so I'm fixing to go edit this and go get it up and get it pre-posted. I usually pre-post all my videos. Now, some videos you may be watching that I did probably last week or something. Usually, I'll tell you if I do that. But I do like to pre-post them. Sometimes that don't always happen. Sometimes I may do the video that morning and then put them up that night or pre-post them, you know, for the next morning, which that is normally what I do. I'll pre-post them to go up at 7 o'clock or whatever. Because I know a lot of you have told me you like me putting my videos up early in the morning. Because I know I have early risers. I'm not one of them, but I know I have early risers. So that's why I have started to put them up at 7 or post them to post at 7. So... There's that, 7 a.m. Okay. Okay. There's all that. And again, I have, my purse will be here Tuesday. You know, I told you my uh, adorned that I ordered from Macari. It is supposed to be here Tuesday and I can't wait to get it. I'm, it's in there. I'm carrying the pink, the vintage pink uh, um, crocodile purse right now. You know, the one I got from Tamu that it looks like the Brahmin. Um, I'm carrying it right now, and um, I can't wait to get that pink one. That pink the adorned, I just can't wait to get it. I can't, I can't wait. So anyway, okay, guys, that's it. I, I for sure, I've, I've talked enough. I don't know how long this is because I've, this is 24 minutes, and I already have another one before this one, so I need to shut up and get off of here. Okay, remember, keep God in it. You'll always win it, and I will either see you guys Tuesday or I will see you Wednesday. I'm not sure. But whatever you do, do it with the Lord. Okay? All right. Bye-bye.